Manchester City's quadruple dream is over after they were beaten 1-0 by Wigan Athletic in last night's fifth-round FA Cup tie. The Premier League leaders peppered Wigan's goal with 29 shots and had 83% of the possession, but were stunned by Will Griggs' goal in the 79th minute. It was a reminder of the surprises that football's greatest cup competition that produce, with Wigan barely given a chance before kickoff. The Latics may reside in League One, but they did something that only Shakhtar Donetsk and Liverpool have been able to do, but beating Pep Guardiola's side. Their task became easier when Fabian Delph was sent off just before halftime, but that doesn't take anything away from their achievement. In fact, City were much improved when they played with 10 men and introduced Kevin De Bruyne 20 minutes after the restart. Guardiola may have left the Belgian playmaker on the bench to start with, but his starting lineup was still daunting, with David Silva, Leroy Sane and Sergio Aguero included. The Argentinian would have been confident of extending his rich vein of form he scored 14 goals in 11 matches before last night, but he will instead be making headlines for the wrong reasons after footage of him clashing with a Wigan fan at full time emerged. Wigan supporters rushed onto the DW Stadium pitch and one of them got into an altercation with the Garo.Fan footage has emerged of the incident, and it shows an extended version of events, with the fan clearly getting close to a Garo. It's not clear what was said to spark such a reaction from Aguero, but Spanish journalist Jose Alvarez Haya, who works for El Chiringuito, claims to know what kicked things off. He says that that fan spat at Aguero and that the Man City striker feared the supporter had an object that could cause harm. The Man City star has been involved in the game long enough to know that his behavior will likely lead to an FA investigation. Tempers ran high throughout the contest, with Guardiola also involved in a heated spat with Wigan boss Paul Cook following Delft's red card challenge on Max Power. <laughs>